Using a tray. In this lesson, we're going to look at how to use a tray during service. We'll be looking at how to best place items on a tray, how to remove items from a tray, and finally, how to clear using a tray. Let's start with how to best place items on a tray. Remember that smaller trays are easier to carry, so you should never use a huge tray to carry one single drink. It will be incredibly difficult to control and looks very silly. For balance and perfect weight distribution, always place the heaviest item in the centre of the tray. This way, you can remove it without changing the weight distribution of the tray. Imagine if you put a freezing cold, heavy beer on the left-hand side of a tray and adjust your balance accordingly. When you take it off the left-hand side, you will change the way the tray is weighted completely and things could go flying. When setting up your tray, the order in which you place the drinks on the tray is important. For example, because we always serve the ladies first, we should set up the ladies' drinks where you can reach first. Next, let's look at how to remove items from a tray. Always remember when you take things off your tray that this will change the balance of the other items on the tray. So always think ahead about how the balance of the tray will change when you are removing something. When carrying hot items, such as tea, coffee or hot soup, always serve the hot items off the tray first. These items are the most dangerous and burning a guest would be an absolute disaster. For this reason, be sure to always take the hot and heavy items off the tray first, remembering how the weight and balance of the tray will change once the item has been removed. It is very important that you know and have practiced holding and moving the tray with both your left and your right hand. This is so that when placing items down, you can swap the tray between hands in order to always provide the guest with open body language. This is excellent service. Finally, let's finish off with learning about clearing with a tray. When clearing an item from a table, always make sure that you have asked the guest whether you may remove the item before taking it. Remember to use an open palm and not to point at the item too. Once you have asked permission and checked your position, you may remove the item from the table and secure it on the tray. When clearing many items off a large table onto a tray, always try to get a colleague to help you. You can get them to hold a big tray or two trays on which you can then place the removed items. This way you will interrupt the guest a lot less as you can allow them to keep their conversation going while you quietly and easily remove the items from the table rather than trying to balance a tray while reaching across them. Well done on learning more about how to use a tray. Good luck.